Hello. How's everybody doing? Who's ready to get eaten by a big fish several times? Let's see. Hello, Ravain, Jenna, Krebeka. Um, and also, Krebeka finishing a tube of Pringles is unending. It's not the good ending, though. <laughs> you gotta finish two bags of Pringles. Also, welcome in, speculative biologist. You did get the disappoint swamp ending. Yep. Okay, honestly, the most annoying thing about this is not just the fact that we have to avoid fish and not be eaten by fish. Um, but it's the fact that I'm going to have to wait until I can teleport to the Ashtwin project. Uh, okay. You landed on the lantern? Oh, yes. I did, I did that. I've been to everywhere. Um... And then also, Krebeka told me about this cute thing where you can find a thing that the Nomai discovered, a four-eyed semi-aquatic life forms in the waterway. I wonder who they could be. Uh, yeah, so I made it to the Ashwin project. I'm going to try and rip out its core and put its core in here. Uh, and also try not to get eaten by fish like several times. <laughs> Feldspar's children. We don't know the life the lifespan of a Perthian. Feldspar could be that old. I should have dozed off at a campfire. I don't imagine Feldspar is older than the species the species evolved from. Feldspar could have been the first Herthian to evolve arms and legs and brain. You're chatting a little shite and you know it. What? Me? No. I'm just waiting for a tower.
Hi, Chert. <laughs> the Horthians are a gender, but the Nomai are a gender. No, no, the Nomai were a gender. <laughs> Welcome in one quacky boy, how's it going? Solanum still may or may not be a gender? Yeah. Solanum uh, is, is a quantum gender. The best kind of gender. I wish there was something else for me to do, or like... I mean, you, you can doze off and speed things up, but I don't know how long to speed things up for to get the tower to the Ashton Project to reveal itself. Solana is a gender while she is being observed. <laughs> Park my ship like right next to where it needs to be because that's pretty cool. Just accidentally. More or less. Don't get cactus. Schrodinger's gender. Stuck my gender in a box with a dangerous and unstable chemical and refused to open said box ever again. Do do. Huh. After all of this waiting, too, I'm just gonna get eaten by a fish, I bet. doing the sand dance. Do, do dancing in the sand. Do 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 do. Three minutes oxygen remaining. That's fine. Have you considered just not getting eaten by space fish? Yes. I have. The fish are just jerks and they don't take my thoughts into consideration. Still don't like the spinning. Yay. 
Okay, come here, you. Bloop. Bleh, bleh. Ah, I almost hit that cactus again. going towards the sun. Don't do that. If you ask them if they're an anglerfish, they have to answer truthfully or it's entrapment. Hmm. Eat le anglerfish legally cannot eat you without your consent. Yeah, there's a white hole in there too. No one ever thinks about the white hole. See, I like the music, but it is kind of distracting because now I don't know how long... <laughs> we have until the sun explodes, because this music is just going to play forever now. Okay. The white hole is privileged. first got the core I thought the core was making the music and would alert all the anglerfish to my existence. Especially since, like, there's one anglerfish close to this hole, but then once we get through this little portal, there's three. <laughs> I thought they were supposed to be territorial. Oh, we're not moving anymore. I can hear the breathing. Come on, drift faster. No, we stopped moving 100%. Shit. No. Oh, come on. You are dead. Okay, yeah, yeah. Credits. We've done that ending before like three times. Okay, can I like wait for like a minute? I don't know if that if that's gonna have done much, but Tag the ship again. Oh, 
Oops, wrong button. No, other twin. There we go. Nope. There we go. Okay. Um, I don't like how autopilot was like making me go into the sun. Hi, Quantum Moon. I think what I have to do is I have to, like, go at, not as fast as possible, but, like, use the, use the engines to get, oh, come on. I'm gonna be sucked up by the sun. Well, okay. <laughs> Thanks, autopilot. <laughs> At least it was a, uh, not a death that matters. But anyway, as I was saying, I think I have to use the engine um, as soon as I get into Dark Bramble and like try to make myself drift as fast as possible before getting close to the stupid fish. Oh no, wait, go back down. I want to doze off for... I did notice, I was looking, I was looking back at, back at the VOD from yesterday and I didn't notice this, but when you like doze off or go to sleep or you close your eyes, the, you can see the, the four eyes close as opposed to just like two eyes. Cute little detail. Oh, I forgot that there was music on Timber Earth. You didn't study for the final exam, oh no, Kitty Ben Ivy. Better reset the day and start over time loop joke. Where are those twins? There they are. I don't get it, me neither. I think these are the twin tower things here. Yeah. Boom. I was like, eh, it doesn't look low enough. One last time, yeah, I'm sure that'll be the the one. 
where I don't get eaten by a fish. Cause I, I, like I said, after we dodge that first fish, there's three more that I have to get past. That'll be exciting, being eaten by a different fish. Whoa. Jump, jump, jump. Jump and spin. Jump and spin the other way. The hit 80s Van Halen song? Yeah. Um, except the Herthian version, so instead of electric guitars or whatever, it's banjos. Yeah, acoustic version. Sand. Timber Herthian cover album. Bucks a bunch of songs for banjo, harmonica, oboe, and whistling. Come here, orb. Cactus? Okay. Bound to dodge the others now. Hmm.
Okay. Not too fast. I guess I missed the hole. Shoot, there's a vine there. What a time to tune in. Welcome in, Dr. Sloan. Yeah, I'm uh, probably going to get eaten by a fish and get a big message that says you are dead, but we are in the end game. Unless someone tells me otherwise. Okay, three fish. No, 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 no. Okay. Hi. Hi. Don't eat me, I swear to God. I'm like leaning in real life to like try to avoid the fish. Oh my god. Okay. I think we've avoided those three, but I don't know if there are any more. How did you not bump into them? Um, I leaned in real life, obviously. Okay, there's another one we got to avoid, but we're slowing down a little. Oh, there's a vine in the way! Are we slowing down some more? There's one literally right next to me. <laughs> Why are there so many of them? Don't want to have to do this again, game. Ooh, I might not have to. Ah, no, 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 Ouch. Uh, where's the entrance? Uh, 
<laughs> where's the entrance? I don't remember. I'm killing you? Oh, it's here. No, wrong way. This way, this way, this way, this way. Go, 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 go. No, no. Nah, 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 nah. Ooh, gravity. Um, all oh right, I was supposed to do this. I don't know what the patterns are, though. What am I supposed to do here? Oh, come on. No, no, no. Orb, come back. Oh, did I not do it? What screen? What are you talking about? Open this thing again. What do you mean? <laughs> Bottom left. Oh, I coordinates. Got it. Did not see that. No, how do I do this one, though? How do you do the... <laughs> how do you do the second pattern? <sighs> okay, wait. I think I got that. Okay, <laughs> I'm pausing. The secret was not starting in the middle. <laughs> oh. Okay, so now this one. Do, 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 okay. Do, 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 do. And then, okay, now, now what do I, <laughs> guild grab, now what do I do? Do I move it around the back of this thing? Now warp how? <laughs> how do you warp if there's no instructions for this stupid shit? To the middle bit. Hmm. 
No. Power the input again. Oh. Do I go outside? What is okay, what does that lead to? Only one way to find out. Oh. That's the way to get out, I guess. Hi, ship. Hi, Quantum Moon. Yep. Yeah. Sounds like it's screaming. Ah. Trees detected. Audio only lurk? Uh, welcome in Oscavarium, and thank you for the audio of it. Wait. So I started off at the North Pole. Ow. So now I'm going to the South Pole? I guess. Somehow. There's no tower. What happens if you get struck by lightning? Okay, so this is like the opposite of the quantum moon, where you start at the south and have to go north. You go Super Saiyan. Here we go. Quantum Saiyan. You're both Super Saiyan and not Super Saiyan at the same time. No, oh, I can't even recall that. Um. Hmm. Do I try to go up or do I go down? Oh, that's not actually a hole. I thought this was a hole. It's just a big pocket. Hmm. 
Looks like a Van Gogh, Van Gogh Starry Night. Okay, well, let's go, I guess. Or I can't, I guess. Oh, okay, the gravity shifted. I understand. Sit a hole, just not a very deep one, yeah. We. Neat. I can take fall damage. No. I'm not gonna take fall damage. Mm. The Nomad never got to see it for themselves, but thanks to their efforts and technology, a Herthian was able to reach the eye of the universe. Okay. Mm -hmm. To explore souls in the universe. Hells for Goss and Slate and Hornfells. Okay. Okay, well, there's nothing that way. Okay, this is not new. Oh wait, hang on, that was new. Uh, Timber Hearth was built to receive transmissions from our deep space satellite and housed some of the last ever photos taken of the entire solar system. One of these photos revealed the existence of an invisible ring world inhabited by a species whose presence in our solar system predated the Nomai. So that's the DLC stuff. Uh, from a nearby star system in search of the app the universe, but horrified by what they discovered, decided to block the eye signal so that no one else would ever find it. Uh, one individual, however, rebelled against the decision and was able to briefly release the eye signal back into space before being caught and imprisoned in solitude for this betrayal. Okay, that's the DLC. Uh, our sun, at the end of its lifespan, our sun collapsed under its own gravity and then exploded in a violent supernova. Look at this jerk. Uh, of all the life forms who will perish in the oncoming death of the universe, we will miss, miss the anglerfish the least. Correct. Oh, look, it's the scout. Probably not my scout. Uh, the Nomai who came to our solar system were following a signal from the eye of the universe. They perished when the interloper arrived, bringing with it the deadly substance we called ghost matter that flooded the entire solar system almost instantly and without warning. <laughs> the anglerfish are dead. Yay! So is everyone else, though. Not yay. Observe. Ah! Um, that blade thing died. Uh, you were the last chance to pick up the ion cannon from the observatory. Oh no! What am I observing? That thing I just looked at died. Oh!
Does that, does that mean that I just destroyed an entire galaxy? It'd be a different ending anyway. Oh, well, they're all dying anyway without my intervention, so... The universe is dying? Oh yeah, that's all the light's gone. And there's only quantum stuff left. My poor scout. Is that m my me? Am I the unidentified signal? It is me. I'm a tree. I always knew I was a tree. I always knew I was two trees. I knew I always knew I was three trees. I always knew I was a campfire. Oh, uh, I. Do you hear music? No. Yes. Fast. Do I? I don't take fall damage now, do I? Uh, there's a banjo in there, but nobody's in touching the banjo. Shot, not sure laws of nature exist, but there's nature everywhere. How do I get the banjo? It's a spooky haunted banjo. Ah, here we go. Gather. Those trees can not commit crime now, yes. Hey. It's um not quite time yet. Are you saying that because we're out of time? Like literally. Uh, I'm pretty sure we'll need the others for this next part. We'll need, you know, everyone. No rush, take your time. It might not even exist here. Cool. And by everyone, you just mean everyone who has instruments and not everybody else on. Oh my god, no. Am I going to be beset upon by another anglerfish? Why do they get to exist? 
Oh, that one's new. Feldspar. I didn't realize how tiny Feldspar was. You found me. Nice to have company around a campfire, isn't it? Go on, go get the others. Wouldn't want them to miss out. So if, if, if one of those stupid anglerfish, if I'm assuming there's going to be more, if one gets me, do I have to restart everything because that's just evil? Oh, this wasn't what I was looking for? That one's just a jump scare, okay. Oh wait, am I going... Oh, I did a loop? No, is this the same campfire as before? Okay. Confused. That's good, because it would be very evil if it was like, hey, you can die, and then you get the you, you are dead ending again. Surprise. Okay. So I'm guessing... no. How do I get over there, then? Okay, well, let's go this way then. The quiet shade. Cross old park. In the ancient glade. It's always dark. Hello, Gabbro? Hi! Well, hi, Gabbro's instrument. <laughs> Come on, hit the... Can I still... Okay, good. Here we go. Boom. Hi, Gabbro. Time... Hey, Time Pal. So you're getting the band back together, huh? I suppose, if any of this is even real. Go on, go find the others. I'll be here. You don't need me yet, but you will. I mean, this is different music. Wait, is this DLC stuff? Yeah. Do I you actually oh Oh, are we building a grave for our friend? Hello, Psycho Ninja Flea, welcome in. The pictures of everybody. End of the Nomai. And a door. Oh. That's grim. Look, it's me. Hi, me. 
I didn't realize how big of a backpack thing we had. Hi, corpse. If I turn around, you're not going to be there. Oh, that's lovely. <laughs> that's so sweet. Where's my crying? That's not crying. This one's crying. Oh, no. That's so sad and cute. So if I go back here, is there going to be... Oh, yeah. I think that's them there. The prisoner. Hi. I can just talk to you, I guess. You're making me cry. It's just so beautiful. Uh, when my kind found the eye and realized that it was what it was capable of, they were terrified. It was too difficult to truth, like a light too bright to look upon directly. It burned them. Uh, what they could not unlearn was hidden away in darkness, obfuscated, then lost. They did not want to see their story end. Uh, my kind weren't always like this. We weren't always so afraid. I did what I could to set things right, yet I am still of my kind. And you know now what they did. I cannot promise our fear won't stain your mind. And so, a choice. Are you certain you want to remember me? Uh, I'm not ready to decide yet. I'm probably just going to say yes, though, because that's cute. Wait, is this where we came from for the DLC stuff? Oh no, that's different. Oh, it's the Nomai. Nomai skeletons. Okay. Ah! <laughs> it's like the one that's in the volcano. Go. Wait, how does this work again? There we go. Are we going to the Know My Home planet? Mask. Okay, now it's just that one that I still don't understand how to get that. Remember what Crab taught me? What did Crab teach me? That Hornfells would find this fascinating. What, this? <laughs> Hornfells, come here, look. Oh, about zooming? Oh. I get it. Okay, now before we... Oh, look, there's... I bet that's Solanum. Okay, no, I want to... We're going to talk to our prisoner friend, because I do want you to join. I don't know how this changes the ending, but they're cute, and I like them, and their horrifying face. And they left us a kind message when they jumped into the water. That one's not that great because the mechanic isn't used that much? Yeah. The prompt is on the screen the whole time. Mm. Uh, join us. But if you're willing to take the risk, then so am I. 
Solano, can I actually talk to you now? Yay. The contest observer has entered the eye. I wonder what happens now. I don't know. Is it time to find out? Yes. Uh, this song is new to me, but I'm honored to be a part of it. Oh, do I just talk to all of them and tell them all to start? Okay, yes. I, to, I thought that they would all just start it and then realize I had to talk to all of them. Solano and the Prisoner Player is like the saddest song ever. Uh, I hadn't dared to hope that anyone would hear the signal. For now, briefly, I set it free. Yet here we are. Are you ready for the final step? Yeah. Uh, send our spark. Send our spark out into the darkness. Wait a minute. Uh, what do you say then? Should I get out of the old harmonica? Yes. Start whistling. Banjo's the best bit, right back. Oh look. We can we can identify all of the That's weird. Okay, chart. Is this the signal that was sent out to everyone? jump in there. So the universe? I made the universe. I made a big bang with my torch. And we get an actual ending that isn't, you are dead. Hooray! And this, these credits have music, so it's a real good ending, probably. Even though you are dead, yes, but a, a different kind of dead, I guess. I don't know. So does that? mean that the signal from the eye was all of us playing around the campfire and that when we turned our because i'm pretty sure it was turning the torch on that created the big bang so it's just a big loop now a big continuous time loop of the universe get the goofy ending there's a goofy ending
highly recommend a quick bonus ending. Well, I've only been going for an hour, so I probably will if... Brand new universe. Okay, that's what I was thinking. I was like, is it just a loop or is it a new universe? But then doesn't that mean that the eye is still there and the signal from the eye is still us playing? I don't know. Brand new universe. <laughs> Uh, this was a good game, turns out. I think I said, like, either in my second stream of this or my first stream of this, I was like, I like it, but I don't know why people think it's a good game so far. Uh, and now I understand. And also thank you for following Psycho Ninja Fleet. Yeah, it could be, perhaps, at the end of this universe, someone will be drawn to your find your song and the cycle begins again. It's very, very nice. I will say, and I think someone said this in my stream yesterday, that the one thing that I, my, my one criticism is that you can't, like, talk to any of the other Hearthians on Timber Hearth about the time loop. Like, the only one you can really talk to about it is Gabbro, and, you know, Gabbro's great. Love Gabbro. But it would still be nice to, like, you know, just have some, some other reason to talk to any of the other Hearthians, because I literally don't know any of their What the eye showed the strangers was the death of their universe? Yes. But the universe was going to die anyway, so... You can have to say it about it, but they just think you've got the space madness. Yeah. I don't know. The universe was going to die in billions of years. Yeah, away from the strangers. Because the strangers arrived in the solar system before the Nomai, and then when the Nomai arrived in the solar system, the Hearthians were only just evolving. So, it was quite some time. Uh, DLC being so disconnected from the shippy ship. My criticism with the DLC is that it was too scary. <laughs> How dare they? That was horrifying. I had like four heart attacks. How long are these credits? Oh, it doesn't look like that that much longer. I just like the music. <laughs> DLC is spooky in such a cool way, yes. Uh, the thing that I like about the DLC is like, well first off, when you first load it in, you get a little notification like, hey, we've had a bunch of people talk about how spooky our DLC is, so we have an option to turn it off so that it's not as scary. So I was like, well that's cool. What a great first message. Um, and then when you land on the stranger before even seeing anything, like the general vibe of the stranger is just scary. Before you even get into like the like the digital world. Thanks for playing Outer Wilds. You're welcome. Thanks for making it. Fourteen point three billion years later. Does our solar system still exist in the new universe? Oh no, this is a new solar system. With new people. Hey, there's my scout launcher. I found it. Ugh. 
<laughs> the new skew. That could be what brings these people to the eye. Oh, that's true. If I didn't launch my scout launcher, does it not fly past? Like, if I just kept it and just jumped into the eye, does that not... This is the new Song College's <laughs> Scouts universe. No, it doesn't. Oh, that's cute. That's a nice detail. I like that. So it's like you can't reclaim your scout launcher because it's in a special scene after the credits. Uh, it's stuck there. You can't get it back. Well, this is a nice game. Um, also, apparently there's a, there's a goofy ending. What do I do to get the goofy ending? It's a very good game. Go to the high energy lab with the with the thing from the Uh, easiest way is to go and wait to the end of the loop. Okay. So go to the Am uh, Ashwin project and then pull the, the, the core out and just like wait for the end of the loop. As extra content? Ooh, extra content. Is it just an achievement? <laughs> Is it like when when Krebeka told me to to bring the the core of the Ashwin project to Hornfells and all I got was an achievement about it? I guess I don't have to tag anything. Multiple secret endings just to clear that up. People were talking about different ones. Oh. Uh, oh yeah, that is. Ashwin always kind of looks like the quantum moon when you're not paying attention. What does Hornfels say? Hornfels doesn't say anything. It, the only thing that happens is that you get an achievement that's called, like, uh, This belongs in a museum. I'd like to not crash into Amber Twin. Thank you. Should have waited at that campfire. Hornfell says Kreb fooled another streamer, huh? Yeah, it's true. you just get an achievement. I think I only have three achievements for this game. I've got the one when you bring the core to Hornfells, and it just says as belongs in the museum. I've got one for walking into a stranger when you're in the Matrix, and it can't blow out your candle, so it snaps your neck, and that. Achievement is called Oof Ouch My Bones. Um, what's the other one I have? Oh, I've got an achievement for running out of fuel and using oxygen instead of fuel. Uh, going back to the guy with such excitement, you're you're gonna get it translated. Then they say it's gonna take six months. <laughs> Mate, I only have twenty two minutes. View map. Oh, I forgot you could do this. You are here. Oh, you can make the quantum moon appear and disappear on the map. That's interesting. There it is. There it isn't. Wait, did we just get sucked up? 
by the sand. We did. I was like, why am I looking down at space? You should probably sleep for a while so you don't have to wait 20 more minutes. Yeah, I should have done. But I didn't think about that. Wait, so how how long after you church camp is the close? Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Should I get the core, go to church camp and sleep for a bit, and then come back to the Ash Twin project? Or should I sleep for a bit? The actually sleeping for a bit first makes more sense, doesn't it? Because I can come to the Ash Twin project at any point. Oh, you don't need to take the core at all? I still need to get into the Ashtwin project. Do, 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 landing. Hi, Chert. Chert's also very tiny. So how long should I wait? How long has it been? Just sleeping, waiting for the sun to explode. Should I do like five minutes? The problem is that you still need to wait for the the planets to line up to be able to teleport to the Ash Twin. And I don't know if that happens like just before the sun explodes. Not more than ten. You specifically need not to take the core? Okay. Just like... See, I was thinking that that might be an ending because um, the casing around the Ash Twin did specifically get built to like withstand a sun exploder. Nope, you're not climbing into the sun, thank you. Oop. Okay, where? There it is. Boom. E smack. Wait, that's the wrong side. It's the one with the cactuses, my arch enemies. We got the scout launcher back. Here comes the other twin. Da -na -na -na. Um, 
In the sequel, they will have anglerfish made of cacti. Oh my god. Oops, no, put this there. I know what it'll show me, but I just wanted to look. Hi, Brittle Hollow. Glad I'm not actually there. Do I have to do something else aside from just be here when the sun explodes? Do I have to stand in front of this guy? Yes, I have to do something else, or yes, I have to stand in front of that guy? This be the mines? I wonder if anyone's played this game and, like, accidentally discovered how to get to the Ash Twin Project before doing any most of the other things. I can see that having that happened. Uh, you've seen that? People accidentally discovering the Ash Twin Project? What's this? Oh, giant steep, right? I've seen someone discover dying at the stranger campfires before discovering fall asleep, falling asleep at them. Oh, that's interesting. Would I like? Um, yes, Rebecca. I tell if you. I'd like to know what I'm supposed to do. Cause the, uh, like I've seen the the actual ending, I guess now. A black hole will form where the core is. Oh. So I should turn gravity off. I still don't like the rotating. You'll notice I don't look up as much. <laughs> it makes me very dizzy. See, but it doesn't. It, there's like no way of knowing which one's yours. Which one of you is my mask? It's not that one. Uh, when I played the DS, I discovered falling off the raft in the tunnels to reach the bottom area on my first time in the dream. Oh yeah, because I, uh, I discovered the invisible bridges before like actually uh, finding the thing that shows you that, that there are invisible bridges in the dream version of the... Not that you understood how it happened or how to reproduce it. Do 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 jets giant steep. Brittle Hollow should give us a good view of if the sun's ready to explode or not yet. I mean, I guess if you find the Ashton Project right away, and you take the core, there you still like there's still nothing to do with the core. Like there's, if you don't, if you've not discovered the Nomai ship, then you wouldn't know what to do with the core.
The sound that plays when you do this is very weird. Also, hang on. La I think the only times that I've ever been to the Ashman Project are when I've pulled out the core. So why does the ship update? Because all of the other times that I pulled the core out, I've died for real. Huh. It'd be cool if like one of the masks had like a nick in it. So you could be like, oh, there it is. This one's the one that's mine. The ship log is basically your character's notes and memories. Yes, but if you die for real, then you can't leave notes and memories. Oh, that's not the right one. I should have, uh, maybe waited at that fire a little bit longer. Low previous save is the text instead of continue. Yeah. Uh, there's no for explanation for when you game over. During normal play, it's because the ship computer uses storage made from Gapro's memory statue. Oh, that's interesting. Something sounds liquidy. Is that the sun exploding? Why do I keep like losing gravity in like one spot? That's weird. Oh no, there we go, there's the music. Sun music, sun music, sun music. Turn off gravity. What? I'm turning off gravity. Gotta hustle cause the sun's gonna explode. the memories are getting sucked up into here. So... Wait, why is it black? That's it? Just that's where the sun 
the memories get sucked up into the black hole every time. That's pretty cool, I guess. Now go back there. Pourquoi? You have now doomed yourself? Look at the map. Wait, so just go... Okay, I'm on the ship. Don't argue with chat, just do it. So should I still, um... Should I go to Ember Twin instead and wait first so that I can get to there? Because, I mean, I can't go to the Ashwin Project anyway, right? would save time but you don't have to wait for the full time loop end no but i'm wondering if i should wait here just to advance time until i can get to the ashwin project is what i'm saying like wait a few like two or three minutes open the ship's map oh you are here but you are also here hmm Yeah, I don't have to wait till the sun explodes, I just have to wait to get to be able to get to the Ash Twin thing. So is there another me stuck in there? Boom. Maybe I'll park my ship closer. That would be smarter. Just that I'm not, like, standing around on a sand planet, waiting for sand to go away. Okay, that's free enough. Right? Kind of, almost. Close. You are here. You are here. If I go back through the time loop again, is there like a third? You are here. You're, you're watching this instead of working. Oh, that's not good. I mean, you know, continue to watch me instead of working. I appreciate. I I like it, but work might not like it. Okay. 
Match speed. Match speed again. Boop, 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 boop. There's still no run button. It is also me stating that I am doing the exact same thing. Uh. Talk to self. Hi, self. <laughs> uh, whoa. What the heck happened? If you're me, then I'm as confused as you are. Uh, do you think we have the same memories? Good question. Let's see. I remember all the time loops, including the last loop when I jumped into the black hole in here. What about you? Me too. Sounds like our memories diverge at the start of this loop. Makes sense to me, seeing how jumping into the black hole is definitely what created two of us. Hey, what do you think happens if you don't jump into the black hole again at the end of this loop? Um, That's a good question. It's something I've been wondering about. We're in thoroughly uncharted territory at this point. Unlike all the other time manipulation we've experienced. <laughs> Truly, we are the feldspar of weird time stuff. Oh jeez, Feldspar would just use the time loop to try increasingly outlandish stunts, wouldn't they? Might be a good thing they aren't aware of it. At any rate, it's been good talking to you... me. Incredibly strange, but good. See you around. Like finger guns. Um... <laughs> ah! <laughs> Just scream at yourself at each other. That's funny. Is that screaming? Uh, are you me from the last loop? I started the current loop by popping out of a white hole inside the Ash Twin. I started at the campfire like usual. Makes sense to me, seeing how jumping into the black hole is definitely what created two of us. Okay, yeah. Guess we'll find out. It's funny that if you just scream at, at yourself, <laughs> the character model just screams. <laughs> That's very funny. So... Is there anything, like, if I, if I do die, if I meditate, for instance, what happens? Like, is this it? It's just that you discover yourself in the Ash Twin? Is there extra? Here's a scout to get a photo of the both of you. Oh, that's a good... That's a good shout. Except for if it glitches through the floor, I guess. Selfie! With me! Are you alright? You seem quite beside yourself. Oh ho ho ho. Ha ha ha. A laugh laugh laugh.
Wait, does this statue activate for our other self afterwards? Because that'd be funny. If you insult the other you, is that self depi Yes. I think if you meditate, it's the same as just waiting. Yeah, no, but I mean, is like, is there something else that happens? Like, if I don't jump through the black hole, does this other me just not exist anymore? Do I have to continue to jump through the black hole? Do this, does this memory statue activate for other me? Try driving into the sun or something. Can I just admit it? I, I guess. Fine, I will. I'll do whatever chat says. You could just meditate it for boring. Hey, being boring is fine. Where's the sun? Sun! Ah, sploosh. <laughs> Perfect, I love it. <laughs> well, that was amazing. <laughs> oh my god, you even get, like, you destroyed the fabric of space-time music. <laughs> I mean, we destroyed space-time, sort of, in the real good ending. <laughs> it just made a new space-time. Your character's bespoke instrument is a kazoo, yes. It's very funny. So my character today. What what did that say? I didn't catch that. There was a someone said something at the end there. Okay, well I'm glad that, that was I got to see that ending. That was very that was funny. Um But anyway. I have now finished the game. I don't know what to stream next. Hooray! I know that there are, like, multiple other endings that people probably want to see me do, but I am tired. Because I had a late night last night, so I'm just gonna... There is a second way to break space-time. Something about going to the... Um... High Energy Lab or whatever. The high energy lab. Okay, how long does that take? I if 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 there's a second way, is it? I mean, you just get the kazoo ending again, right? Five minutes after getting the. Okay, we'll break the universe again. How quick you can get to the lab? I don't even remember how to get to the lab. Like, there's a path, right? Path from the Sunless City. So am I getting to the- am I going to the high-energy lab first, or do I go to the Ashton project first?
You don't need to go to the Ashton Project at all. Okay. Oh, wait. I'm gonna put this on. We'll break the universe one more time. But then I'm definitely gonna call the stream, because... I'm sleepy. I'm a sleepy little frog. Oh, does this have something to do with the black and the white holes that are at the higher entry lab? If, uh, no, if it, Ash Twin would move out of the way a bit. Thank you. think about it did you figure out why you got those blue lines on your screen all the time ran out while you're on the stranger um no i'm sure there's more stuff to explore there uh, this is the start of the path don't remember how to get to the sunless city It's because you didn't don't die in the supernova, so your memories just get pulled back without you dying. Oh, that's weird. The stranger moves away to keep itself safe from the supernova. Oh. Oh god. Yeah. I should have read the instructions. Uh, walk forward until you meet the sandfall at the pit, then turn left. Just continue from rock colors and climb upward. There we go. Be cautious crossing the chasm ahead. Blah blah. Blech. Uh, to reach the shelter side, you can rest here. Hurry before the sun. Where's the? Oh, it's up there. Uh, that's what breaks the dam. The stranger detects that the sun is going supernova and deploys its solar sails, and the resulting shock damages the dam. Okay, and then I'm assuming that the the mask slash statue still pull your memories because you're getting too far away from them. But wait, so then if you don't die, that means that that does... There's another you on the stranger then, doesn't it? Like a you with no memories? Oh, they activate when the supernova happens. Got it. Trees, please. Okay, which one of you leads to high energy?
Perfect. I heard you laugh. So then, shouldn't dying on the stranger uh, cause a time anomaly and end the universe? Fucking sand. It looks like being reset in time to you, but what really happens is that a new version of you wakes up and suddenly receives all the previous memories of a previous loop. It's not a time anomaly if the ATP is still active. Your memories get sent back now if the ATP is already deactivated. What's the secret ending? Like finding out about the stranger? Now. Deactivating the ATP and then going on the stranger and let it safely carry you away from the supernova. No ATP means your memories can't be sent back, and being far enough from the supernova means you don't die either. Oh, that's interesting. Um, how do I get to... <laughs> so you just live there now? With all of the corpses who don't die, I guess. Um, is this the way to the high energy lab, or do I have to go somewhere else? I don't remember. Am I going forward? Or is the door locked over that way? Uh, Two thirds of them die because the dam is breaking. Right. Which way am I might go into the high energy lab? It's been a while. Do I go forward or do I go up? Because it looks like there's ghost matter up. I don't want to do this all over again. Keep going, the entrance further ahead. Okay, thank you, Ender Agender. Welcome in. I have completed the game. We're doing endings. We're doing secret extra endings. It's just been a while since I've been to the high energy lab. Okay, what am I doing here, y'all? Did I put a black hole in a black hole? A white hole in a white hole?
Did I put a nothing core? Nothing. Make there be two scouts? How? Energy? This is the reason you need a supernova? Oh, so we're just waiting for the sun to explode? Or we're just doing this? Please. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Neat. You destroyed the fabric of space-time. Good. You shouldn't have done that. But then we get a nice kazoo ending, I imagine. Yeah, look. I like destroying reality. It's fun. And I think everyone should do it. Who doesn't love destroying reality? I still don't know what they say at the end there. Okay, but now I've destroyed reality twice. We've s saved a different reality once. We've been eaten by a fish like three times. Um, so I'm going to call it there. They're saying, that's obvious. It's great. Uh, yeah. Um, I've, I'm also, like, two, one or two streams away from being able to apply to be affiliate, so that's fun. So I might stream maybe tomorrow and Wednesday. Uh, if I do, it'll probably just be Hades, just because it should be, you know, a quick little thing to get in. Um, yeah. So, if anyone has suggestions on who we should raid, otherwise I'll just end stream. Uh, we did a final exam. Everyone passes. Good job, everybody. Your new homework is to just take it easy. You don't have to, you don't have to uh, homework anymore. So we've done an exam. Hooray! Yeah, because the uh, I don't follow a lot of people. The only person that I'm following that's live right now is probably going to end soon also. So um, I feel like Fizzy's going live sometime soon, but no idea when. Oh, now. Perfect. We can, we can raid Fizzy then. Fizzy Bear. Fizzy can get a nice start of stream raid. And that'll be perfect, because then I'll be able to eat while watching Fizzy stream. Everybody say hello to Fizzy. I will see you all tomorrow, probably, for just some quick Hades, so I can get affiliate, etc. Thank you, everybody, for joining and for telling me about how to destroy the universe in two different ways. Wow. Okay, I think I hit right now. Bye. Thank <laughs> you.